I am Adam. And I'm Christy. And we are Heavenly, Heavenly Hikes, Hikes and, and Travels. We live in the beautiful state of West Virginia, and we have been blessed to travel all over the world together. And now that our children are grown, we bought a truck camper and are excited for the many adventures that await. So come with us on all of our heavenly hikes and travels. Well, good morning from Gooseberry Falls State Park. We stayed here last night in the campground, had a great night. We were actually awake from one to two, looking at the sky. We had clear skies last night. We had high hopes of seeing the Northern Lights, but we didn't get to see any. I took a picture though of the beautiful stars. Uh, maybe one day, we still have a few more nights that we'll be here, so in this area. Anyway, we're gonna do a hike this morning uh, to, Goose, to Gooseberry Falls. It should be beautiful. Fifth Falls. Fifth Falls? Fifth Falls. It's Fifth Falls, sorry, it's in Goose, Gooseberry State Park. Anyway, should be a wonderful hike, so we'll take you along with us. It's a really nice campground. Nice. No water, no electricity at the site. So yeah, just nice wooded there's lots. A, there's a dump station. All right, well, we're off on our hike. Well, it's raining. We did have uh, some blue skies this morning and uh, it didn't look like it was supposed to rain, but yeah, anyway, we're just gonna make the best of it regardless. raining a little bit so uh, we're gonna kind of we're gonna stand here for a minute stand here underneath this tree maybe it'll maybe it'll blow over all right well it's slowed down on the rain uh, we are now on the Gitchagumi Trail, which should take us uh, to the Lake Superior shore. So, uh, yeah.
I'm loving this trail. Oh, it's so gorgeous. It's crazy how similar this coastline, shoreline, looks like Pacific, the Pacific coast. It's crazy. You'd think you were in uh, Oregon. Or Nova Scotia. Or Nova Scotia. Gooseberry Falls was a wonderful stop. Now we are headed to Split Rock Lighthouse State Park. And it is still raining. Now we are at Split Rock Lighthouse State Park. And we're gonna walk out to see if we can get a view of the lighthouse. All right, here's a little bit of information. There is the Split Rock Lighthouse State Park that's right beside the Split Rock Lighthouse historic site that you can pay for a tour of the museum and the lighthouse. But the better pictures are from the state park. And that's where we went. We skipped the tour. It is, it is beautiful, beautiful place. Look, Bella, I got you a treat. It's a moose treat. She's like, give oh, it. Oh, she likes that. She's like, give it. Next stop is Tedagooch State, 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 State. <laughs> State Park. All right, so we're taking a little uh, detour here to the Black Beach.
All right, Adam is going to explain um, <laughs> the black beach. Well, it's rocks, it's not sand. Yeah. Basically, it's just tailings from or leftovers of an iron ore process that's washed down the river and then the waves and whatnot of the Lake Superior has pushed it back up and so it looks like a beach. A black beach. Anyway, it's really cool. We enjoyed it. Yeah, it's fun. We walked all over the place. Now we are at Tetaguch State Park and we're going to walk out to look at some falls. All right, so uh, we just walked down 200 stairs to get to this two-step waterfall. Uh, now I gotta climb back up 200 stairs. <laughs> it's gonna take me just a little bit. Well, I made it back up to the top. Back to the truck. So we are now on the Gunflint Trail. It's a road that takes you into the Boundary Waters, and we're headed to a campsite, a campground, uh, the Trails End Campground, and I'm really keeping my fingers crossed and praying hard to see some moose. We shall see. trying to find us a spot you have to go pick out your site and then go re register well we found our campsite and it's right by this beautiful lake I'm gonna walk down there in just a little bit and show you guys but what a gorgeous drive on the gun flint trail it's a scenic byway and oh my goodness it was so so pretty there's water all around little ponds and lakes everywhere moose heaven so I'm really hoping that maybe we'll see one. Who knows? But I'm going to wrap up this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for more beautiful scenery. Who knows what we'll get into. We'll see you on the next one.